So, ladies and gentlemen, yes, everybody is ready. Are you all ready? Hello, okay, Salma, Shatri, yes, Regina. Okay, Regina Karka, Salma, Shatri, Regina Karka. Double, double students are there. Rita, oh, hello. Good evening to each and every one of you. Hello, yes. sir. Good evening. Yes, yes. Good evening. Good evening. Good okay. evening. Sir. Are you all right? Okay, Tilak Bhandari. Wow, wonderful photo. Wonderful photo. Heroic pose. With the spectacle, ah, oh, it's so wonderful, you know. Yes, thank you. yes, thank you very much. Yes, I was actually so keen on to listen. Thank you. So, as my promise, I have made over there. So today, I'm just actually going to share with you the causative verbs, whether these students have forgotten or not. Yes, hello, Sean. Rajan, sir, could you just actually allow me to share my page, please? Yes. Hello, sir. Now you, you can, Rajan. Yes, thank you. All right. So, yes. I'd like to open my page. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, just get ready for this. And then we will just uh, see, i like to check, you know, so these uh, students are okay or not. Yes, one by one. Yes, quietly, please note down the answer yourself. I don't want actually anyone being to uh, just talked about, say, a blown away. One student is very perfect and he or she will talk it. And then the rest, uh, the rest of the students are zero again. I want each and every students to understand this. So let's start from this question number one. Causative of section, question number one. So my question goes to you, and that is, would you like to get your money as this? Once again, yes. The thing is, now, please give me the answers from the option given. Is it A, B, or C, and D? Hello. So start, your time starts now. Please note down the answer. And then just actually let me go to the next question, please. This is what student will do it, okay? So always, I, but, but remember one thing, whenever you write down the answer, please tell me, you know, what formula did he use for this? I don't know. So randomly, this is my answer. Everybody will know. So it must be random. Or some student will see this actually in a minute. Okay, I'll put this number A. <laughs> this is not happening. I'm so sorry for that, ladies and gentlemen. What will have to do it? You'll have to clarify this. Anyone? Number one, answer is clear, I think. So would you like to get? So in this section, what I got over there, get. It's a cassette verb. So get is my cassette verb. And right after get, I have got actually your money. What it is, is it personal, impersonal as in? Then you find it out and then decide yourself. Answer me, please. What is your answer? Tell me. Hello. Hello, Regina, would you answer me, please? I would, would you like to get your money desk? Where everybody is silent today. Be count. What is this? Ah, sorry. Nanu, you did not understand the theme of this. Yes. Would you just actually see, get, see the formula again, you forgot the formula, you know, right after get, if personal as in comes, if any person comes, then I'll have to use to infinity. So in get, you know, just actually, or I mean in causative verb, B and count, that option is not there. Option A is out of topic, so I will drop this. So number B, two count. So for this, 
I'll have to get personal agent over here right after this. As an example, would you like to get your friend? Not your money, your friend. Would you like to get your friend to count once again? That is okay. Or I would like to get my friend to count him again. That is okay. But the problem is over there, your money after causative verb. So what could be your answer? Options are there down by C and D options are also there. Can I go with B count? Can I go with two count? Can I go with counting? Or oh, can I go with counted? Yes. Counted. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Would you define me, please, Nano? Why count it? Would you tell me uh, something about the formula? Get class. your money. Uh, your, your money, money is ah. Your is impersonal agent and it is impersonal agent. That's why I'll have to use the third form of the verb is the correct answer. So let's have a look at the answer. Hey, eh? yes. No, no, let's have a look at the answer. Is it right or wrong? Oh, yes, you are 100% correct. Yes. So in my quiz, yes, one of the students actually got the right answer and she gave me a very good, you know, the formula for this. I really owe for you, grand salute for you. So would you like to get your money counted? Uh, refund it or just actually this is uh, the refund it or disbursed whatever comes after gate plus impersonal as in right after that i'll have to use uh, above three so shall i take you for this even to the board or you people know it everybody knows this formula oh yes there are some students actually right oh sorry Sorry, Vataji, I'm so sorry. Yes, but actually, Regina Ranamagar, thank you very much. You deserve this. And then actually, this is, so some students are still confused. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'll have to take you back to the board again. So what the, my board talks about, see, okay? So in the board, I'll have to give you the clarification for this, okay. So what we are doing is a causative verbs, okay. See, what we are doing is the causative verbs. So causative verbs, you know. So our first question was based on this formula subject and plus actually the causative verb get or even the causative verb gets or got or have got, have got, or has got, whatever I just actually find it. So get, gets, got, have got, has got, whatever I get it. So right after this got, or I mean to say, got ko pachari, kosto khalko agent cha. Yes, they may give you two types of agent over there. One is personal agent, and another one is impersonal. So impersonal can be an object as well. Impersonal is also known as an object, okay? So it depends. Personal is equal to your friend, your just actually a brother, sister, your teacher, or just actually whatever person or never just actually, or I mean someone in the neighborhood or after gate or got somebody, someone, anything is given, then I'll have to just actually use, see, if there is personal agent, you will find it, then you'll have to use after personal agent, two plus verb one is always your right answer. This is also known as two infinitive is used. But in case if there is impersonal as in, then the students will have to answer yourself with the third form of the verb, also known as past participle form of the verb. 
PP form. PP form is equal to this actually the third form of the verb is called past participle. So from this, I can derive two formulas from this God now. So according to this God, there are two formulas can be just actually constructed. So for equation of formula number one, S stand for subject, okay, see. My formula number one goes this way, subject, and after that get, or after that get, or even just actually have got, yes, or has got, ever I get it, see, and right after this, if I do have personal agent, then I'll have to use two plus verb one for those who could not answer it clearly. Now examples, okay. I get my sister. See, I get my sister. Does that my room? See, so what could be the answer? Ladies and gentlemen, ready to answer me. So option A is equal to, I just actually clean, yes. Option A, I'm writing clean over there, okay? And option B, I will write to clean myself, okay? And then option C, another one, cleaning, okay? And, and option C is all about cleaning. And option D is all about clean, aha. Uh -huh. So what could be the answer? Could you reply me, please? I get my sister. What to write? To clean. Ajur. What to write? Two plus to infinitive. So two plus verb. Can it say? Erno, erno, nani baboru ali active byra. Two plus clean is equal to verb one. So. This is my correct answer. Did you understand? Bhusnu bhaiya, hello. Aba tu, a get, get ko kunai pani form, followed by, this ko pachi, personal agent I ma, my sister, banne ko yo manche ho ni hai na ra. Get ko pachari, my sister, my brother, my father, my teacher, my professor, whatever. Jese ke yaos. Any bhakti ka to bani, bhakti sanga relate ka to bani, get sanga jai le bani two plus bhav one lagauni. See, abo another formula that I have to derive from there is see subject, and then the next one is causative verbs like get, and another one is got. And then the next one is have got whatever comes just to chaos or even has got because I got got one list of the Python. So this is a positive verb. And if it is impersonal, what do you mean by impersonal or bactic or bactic? I mean, other than person, bhakti banda bhaira ko kone panichis. Yes. Bekti hoina ke get ko pachari is to sabda ayo jo bekti hoina impersonal means actually something object you know objective case yo I ma I'll have to use the third form of the word so the example goes this way okay I just actually have got my room oh ho. So I have got my room does this. I have got my room does this. See, so for this same case again. So shall I write to clean? Hello? Shall I write to clean myself? Ke maya to clean banera lekna shak chu bane hai mai le. Shall I write to clean in an option A? So my option A is to clean. Ke yo mero answer hola ta. 
my question number one hey is my answer is slide right cleaning over here bujer mate answer garne ho nani baburu nam nikalnu garo cha we'll have to understand and do it if you can understand everybody is a past one past candidate this is what i mean those who try will never failure yes failure is the stepping stone of success koshish garne ko kaile haar hodaina ekai choti naam nikalnu cha ekai choti dang 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 ma koshish garchu sir tara naam chai nikalnu cha yes come on you are the one just actually you are the ideal city uh, just a candidate for that to clean cleaning and then the another one cleaned and then the next one is equal to the another one cleaning to clean clean and just actually another only clean okay now how much you answer one to hola just actually could you answer me please for this clean no. sir पर But uh, my room is actually impersonal agent, so I'll have to use clean is my correct answer because this is the third form of the verb. So this is what I call verb three. So this is my correct answer. Yes. So I did it. La. Firi, I'm back. Jump please, ma. Because actually we have to have many questions, you know, to complete over there. Okay. Yes. There is someone just actually writing, you know, to clean and clean. No, it's very good. Yes, very good. So your answer is counted. Very good. No, is my counted? Kina boy ola because of your money. Yes. Okay, your friend wante bani ma two plus babu an lagaute. Next questions. Okay, very easy questions. Maid is a causative verb. Teacher is a subject. Abu made is equal to one way formula. Make ma there is no alternatives at all. Is ma kunei apu baadharu chai na where I get made directly I will go to the first form of the verb. So our formula shows that make makes made has made have made whatever comes. You made को पचारे यो खाली ठामा माइले first form of the verb should be always written. There is nothing about agent. I don't check about anything at all. यहाँ इसको पचारे made को पचारे him दियोस या made को पचारे the fan बनोस just anything else कि ना मुझे इसमें impersonal object आउ दे ना after made make and mix. इसमें इम्पर्सनल भब्जेक्ट को अलवेज दर इज अ पर्सनल एजेंट सो इसको अल्टरनेटिव हो सो मेक मेक्स मेट देखियो कि तीधे भब को पेलो फॉर्म लगने सो कुड यू रेस्पोड दिस आंसर प्लीज मैं आंसर हेन हतार भैस हेलो नानी बाबू कुड यू प्लीज ये Stand, stand! Wow, wow! Yes, you exactly go back, boy. You Pratima Thapa, you Nanu ko. Do it, I answer right, boy. Hey, very good, Nanu. Keep it up. Just actually, but let me check this answer. Stand, correct. No doubt at all. Easier questions, but number three. Ah, this made same thing again. Yes, like check करने जरूरत देखी ना I don't want to check this again. The teacher made the late comers what? क्या बो? To stand, stand, to be stood or standing. What is the correct answer? Stand. Very good. नानो ठीक की बेटी तब तब तो येरनो परे तो oh yes, you are right. 
Now number question number four. Again, got oh my gosh. You got rahab. You do it all I say, do it all you care. Lot to put it in Jake. I mean, yes. So you look on that, you're gonna get rahab, get rahab. Meet, no problem. Get rahab. These are two mo most important questions, you know, that students actually find it too difficult. Sometimes they are totally confused, you know. You get to have Shangha totally students are often confused. So, Amit got his radio, please get ready now. After God, I got this radio, his radio. So his radio is personal or impersonal, tell me. Azur. Hello, yes, anybody? Oh, what's in the chat box? My answer, like, you yes, two students actually, Pratima and Salma. Yes, they gave this actually the correct answer because it is impersonal agent. So, radio doesn't work in itself. They were a million personal baneko, you know, very positive, Bob Baneke or Kalai or Aunu Baneko. So around a kalagi pan the man che bhai na around no. Amit got his radio la. A usko radio la kya gano only. So that's why repair at the shop. Correct. In this statement, got followed by impersonal agent. So repair is the correct answer. Very good, wonderful. Wow, these students I think will make the revolution in this. I think. And what is question number? Oh, yes. I was wondering about this. Yes. So just actually see what is there, number five. Okay. Number five, what is there? Okay. Aba esko takai just actually ulta. Ogi ko get rap. Ulta. Butsaki buddhaina vidyadili ulta baniko. It is just reciprocal, you know. Just actually get ko pachari to pahili impersonal huda. What did you write? Bob three, you know. So just actually impersonal huda. Bob three use garna bo. Personal huda two infinitive. See. Aba isma chai ke lagao da thik uncha sudha. Had a maid servant. So a maid servant is a personal agent. Aba for this. What are you going to just actually do for this? See, Shuda had a maid servant. What? To clean the kitchen? Okay. Or even cleaning the kitchen? Or even clean the kitchen or clean the kitchen? Any answer, please? Had, have, has, had. Kupachari pati tapai sanga, maid servant vanera. What is given over there? One of the personal agent, Baniko Kam Gorni Mansala, maid servant Bansa. So some of the students answer me over there. Clean, clean. Okay, okay. So hat plus personal agent followed by the first form of the verb. Hat ko, hat ko, hat ko, hat ko pachari. The pahili edhi personal agent bheti noon chavane. You'll have to use the first form of the verb. So let's check this. Whether it is given there, just actually see. So you cannot use two infinitive. Nata use actually the third person. Sudha had or maid servant clean the kitchen. So have has had plus impersonal a personal agent is equal to above one and impersonal agent is equal to so what could be the right answer the student will find this okay so does your mother get you yes what could be the answer for this number six question number six <coughs> Answer me, please. Question number six. Does your mother get? That means actually after this Kazeti Bob, I have got one of that agent over there, you. So you is my agent. Whether it is personal or impersonal, you'll have to find it out and then act accordingly. Get followed by personal agent is equal to what to write. Yeah, it's your duty, okay? 
So most of the students wrote it, you know, do work. Wow, that's wonderful. That is very wonderful. So they all wrote about two infinitive. Let's check the answer. Yes, but the answer is not given there. But your answer, correct answer is number D. Two plus infinitive is your answer. So two work is your answer. Number seven, please. The teacher dash dash the students. Okay. Now, which causative verb? And then what is its impact on there? So which causative verb do you want to write for this? Okay. The teacher dash dash the students. Okay. On the bench, and they had come. Okay, tense structure. They had is equal to past tense, ladies and gentlemen. So I cannot use simple present as a causative verb. So had is given in the past. So I'll have to find out the past tense over there. See, past tense, see. Past tense over there, mix is given in simple present, Bob five. Number B is equal to mid, okay. So, and then number C is equal to mid, and number D is equal to make. Since had is given, so it is given in the past, I cannot use an option A and option D. Cancel. Our motion is option B and option D. अब तेज पची स्ट्रक्चर को खोजी करनुं स मेट लगाए पची की लिखनु पड़ता अरे मतलब मेट को पचाड़ी स्टैंड और स्टैंडिंग तो भाई को हाथ में चा आंसर सो स्टूडेंट विल जस्ट एक्चुअली सी मेट स्टैंड वेरी गुड बी नंबर इज आंसर वाव वंडरफुल वंडरफुल बी आंसर ओके बी इज योर करेक्ट आंसर वेरी गुड तो भाई � so let's check this. Made and stand is the correct answer. By the way, about your questions, I'd like to interpret these questions, you know. Edi Malaya have come, Baneko Baiti, Kia Karte, Ola. No answer, Dinus Malay, please. Because this is actually interpreted on the basis of the tenses. So to had come, Kutama Malay, have come, Adaba only come. Boko Baiti, Kia Karte, Ola, my lay. Maile B or D like cancel and then A and D like more answer manner. Agari birthday. But both answers are not correct. So the teacher, the teacher is there. So I could have focused on this max. And then you're standing, why not? I could have written with the teacher makes the students stand on the bench as they have come without homework. So easily, sometimes we'll have to act on the basis of the tense as well. So that's why this type of questions can be asked. So where students are confused, that is the loophole for us, the teacher, the question maker for Lok Shiva, you know. Yes. So, See, this is it. Whenever you practice, you practice overly. So fill up the blanks with proper forms of the verbs. Again, causative verbs over there. So now for this, again, the same thing. I'd like to ask you the question from number eight. So what is that number eight? Okay. So again, the formula is the same. Only the tense structure has changed. Our students, ladies and gentlemen, the corporation, okay. The corporation is, okay, is, okay. Was, ah, nowadays, present. So option C, I will cancel myself because it is useless. Did you understand? Nowadays means, this actually present moment these days. So this is in the present. So I can never use was getting. So number C, I will cancel it at the beginning. 
Then the rest of the options I will check on the basis of. So get is a form of getting. Getting is made out of get. It's a causative form. So I'll have to use according to the causative structure. So our get ko pachadi mo kecha mero agent ya nera the roads over there. So the roads is equal to uh, personal or impersonal. You'll have to find this out. So and what could be your right answer? Dere nani babu arle ya nera interpret gari shaknu bo is getting or repair. Wow, wonderful. Is getting and repair. Aba na pusne leche please ha to thay din hola. Maile bujina bandin no hala. Aye, that because I don't know if you can't talk, I can't understand. Okay. If you ask me the questions, I'll make you understand. Okay. Number nine. Nayan. That's that's his father. Okay. So God gets God got. So if I'll have to go to God, then I'll have to find out that these questions should be given in the past. So that's why, let me check this. Who had promised is over there. Because of this had, I cannot use present. So I'll have to use past. So please cancel gets. Number B is cancel over there. Number B is cancel. So after that, what to do? Oh my gosh. So is my answer A or C or D? Please note it down there, please. Okay, okay. But one of the students, whose answer is this? Number B, you wrote it, okay? Your Ogilo answer, hola. Everybody just actually see D, D. Okay, very good. Ranju Rai, correct. Regina, very correct, okay. But how come there's a student use this number D? It's given in the past, point number one. That's why I'll have to use God over there. So right after God, oh, his father is there. So his father is a personal agent. So I'll have to use two infinity for this. That's why my correct answer is number D. Oh, yes. Very good. Excellent, ladies and gentlemen. You all have been doing a fabulous job. Wow. confirmation I'm very happy for this. So next number, the teacher, that's, that's the students on the base, they had not. Okay, so give me the answer, please. Madam, could you just actually bring uh, hot water, please? The teacher does that's the students, okay. Oh, one of the students wrote it. Yes, I'm so excited to see his answer, you know. Rita Poon, she wrote about number B. Yes, number 10, is it number B? Ah, number B, there is actually made over there and right up to made, and I need this actually there. Bob Wan, wow, that's wonderful, wonderful. Made and then plus Bob Wan, it's wonderful. Let me check this, okay, see, wow, that's great. And then question number 11, yes, what is over there? I have my car, okay. So for this, okay, I have my car, okay? Number just actually see, so have one. Let me go to the structure to check it because some of the students have already submitted their answer, but while rest of the students are quiet, you know? So that quietness, you know, will kill me one day because I don't want any students, you know, just actually to get very silent, desolate, or I mean, just actually dejected or well, this is what actually, I don't want this. So for this, so let's just actually find out what is this, you know, have, okay. And then the has, okay, or even had. And then after this, if you get the personal agent, yes, we just actually, if you get the personal agent, then what you'll have to do it, yes. Would you just actually give me the solution for this, please? 
if there is any personal agent or the agent relating to person, then just actually I told you to use the first form of the verb. Yes. But if there is for the same case, if there is have, has, or had, and after that impersonal agent, okay. So for impersonal agent, then I'll have to use the third form of the verb. I mean, I'll have to use the PP form of the verb. Okay. So this is what I call past participle form. This is called PP form. Okay, sorry. Yes. So as an example, let me just actually go with this. Okay, I have. Yes, sorry. I have. Yes. My sister. Yes. I have my sister. That's, that's my room. Yes. So what you're going to write for this? My sister is a personal agent. So if you would like to just actually use this clean or even the another one to clean, okay? And then the another one, just actually third one is equal to cleaned, yes? Or fourth one is equal to cleaning. So what could be the right answer? Could you answer me, please? Hello? Could you answer? I have my sister, what to do for this? Because after have, Clean. has had. So if I get actually personal as it, then always I'll have to use the first form of the word. So this is my correct answer. So I'll use clean my room. But in case if, okay, in case if, for the same, yes. Okay, I have, or has, or have, okay. And after that, if it is impersonal, okay. So impersonal as in, then you'll have to use the third form of the verb as I've already mentioned above. So let's go back to the questions and then we will just actually try this perfectly. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, okay, I have my car. That's us at my friend's garage every three months, okay. So what could be the answers over there? Hello? Number Sorry. 11, what could be your answer? Hello, is it number B? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, yes. Why number B? Could you define me, please? I have my car. Okay. What? Serviced at my friend's garage. Because my car is not a personal agent. So this is an impersonal agent. So I'll have to use number B. Is that clear? Hello? Hello, yes, Nani sir. Baburo? Yes. yes Did you understand? Are you building chata? Let's take the answer. Service is the correct answer. Very good. And what about the next one? Okay. La have bola richer and students turn over there, number 12. Okay. What is there in number 12? Hello. Okay, did you just mention the answer in the chat box, please? The Paiko answer chat box, my heaven, but I'm so excited, you know, when they will write the answer and I will just, oh, yes, yes, yes. Two, two students has wrote it over there. Ah, but the answers are differentiated. My goodness, number 12 answer is totally differentiated. One of the students wrote with number, but I don't, I don't disclose the name, eh? One of the students wrote A. Eh? Oh my God. So what to do over there, see? Usually, usually is always used for simple present tense, point number one. When I use usually, that always indicates simple present. So I cannot use just actually this uh, 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 past over there. So option A cancel. option A I'm so sorry for that. Usually, if you want to write, we had a car serviced yesterday. Unuparthiyo usually hai ke. Yesterday, we had our car serviced. Yes, go third form, no? So it is not mentioned over there. 
Sorbis is the first form of the verb. And number B, this is given in present, okay? Number C, has, we, sang has, we never use it. Option A also gone, option C also gone. Option B and option D, yes. Our option B, we have our car, correct. Option D, we have our car, correct. But after this, our car, I need the PP form, I mean the third form of the verb, but my verb is serviced, but it's not served. Serviced is equal to, to do the service, I mean in the garage, but this car is not going to serve in the garage. Car is not a, just actually bellboy. Car is not a waiter over there. That it will just actually keep on serving something there in the garage. So your right answer is number B, but not number A. One of the students wrote, you know, that it is number A, sir. So there is the problem. Okay, but so many students, you know, B, 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 wow, wow, that's wonderful. And then let's check the answer, you know, question number 12, B. Okay, correct. Then let me go to the next one quiz for this. Question number 13. Usually we does this our same to same answer. So question 12 and question number 13, we just actually already did it. So let's go to question number 40. Ah, too easy questions, you know. It is so easy questions, okay. So the police made him what? Confess his crime? Confessed his crime? Well, let me go to check the structure. The police, subject, made is my causative verb. Him, I don't care. Make, makes, made. In this, whether personal, impersonal, there is no questions of impersonal. After make, made, and makes. That's nothing. They cannot give you the impersonal as in. Sorry, it is, it, it, it is actually a odd structure. So this type of structures are never ever asked or given. So that's why I'm sorry for that. So made him. So definitely your answer should be there. So what could be your answer? Most of the students, I think they have written on this. Okay, hello everyone. Oh yes, yes, it's good, it's good. So every student, I think, now have got the ideas of this, okay. And question number 15, okay. See, question number 15. Oh, question number 14A, correct. So I'll have to check the answer. Definitely this is A, confess is equal to, to accept. And number 15, the teacher made the naughty boy. Ah. Two easy questions, you know. So now your just actually answer should be, what could be your answer? Number C, tiptoed. Yes. Tiptoed means actually to make him stand on his toe. Kutta ko agadi pati ko yo yo kutta ko agadi pati ko bhag lai ma tekera ubine banayo. Pachadi ko khutta uchale ra, yo, yo. Yes, it is a, a kind of exercise as well. This is a kind of therapy, you know, that is called tiptoed. To stand upon just actually the front parts of the leg is called tiptoed. But the teacher made the naughty boy, okay? So I need the first form of the verb, see, tiptoe. Yes, this is recently kept word in English uh, dictionary, you know, tiptoed, yes. It's recently kept the word okay. So the next one, see, we just actually did this. It was so wonderful that every student just actually deserved this number C. Wow, very wonderful, you know. Yes. So right after this, I would like to just actually get some text on, okay. Yes. The next one, difficult, okay. Uh, questions on tax. Yes. Questions on tax. Okay. Yes. 
All right. So, yes. Let's go to find these difficult questions and facts because tomorrow I'm just actually going to come with difficult, just actually tech questions, okay? So what sort of difficult tech questions will be there? Let's have a look at this. Yes. C. So tax number this, okay? So start the test. See, start the very top test in this. Complex question tax. So choose the correct answer over there. So it is very easier. Yes. So it is very easier. But for this, actually, this the, the down one, which sentences are correct? Eh? These are APF and cadet, army cadet questions. Hey, eh? this. AP of the top one, just actually you can do it. We know this. I just actually wanted to show you which sentences on the basis of that question is correct. This is uh, the cadet and APF questions. Frequently they will ask these questions. So which option among them is correct? See, I just would like to just actually show this, you know, to the students. See, the sun won't sign tomorrow. Which option is correct? Please uh, tell me now, students start. Question number one, which option do you think is correct? Hello, could you, could you write it on the chat box, please, that question? The one that the, so the Sean won't sign tomorrow, will it? Or the son one sign tomorrow will see. Or the son one sign tomorrow want it. Which one is the correct answer? Do you have any answers of that question, please? Which option is correctly given? You'll have to click that. Is it number one? T. We will have to check. We will just actually check. See these questions. Why I'm showing you, see, these are APF and cadet questions. Yes. For, from the just actually, for, for the last one, one and a half years, these questions actually are frequent over there. At least two to three questions were asked, but given from there, this, this format. It's not actually on the format on top, but these questions were given on this format. So please use this actually now. I'm just actually uh, uh, doing this. Uh, I will copy the website of this, I mean, and send it even to your chat box. You can just check it. And then at home, you try yourself because some of the students are so leverious here. So I would like them to just actually try this. Even by mobile also, you can do this. So let me just actually go to this. Okay, see? I'm going to paste it. I hope everybody got this actually the website. Did you get it? Please respond me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, click got a visit up a page my pugnunta. And you don't try to do the top questions, even then if you do it, it's okay. But the, the questions given just actually this. They, they don't write that questions here only. I'm telling you which option is correctly given. Statement plus tag. Both you'll have to test it. Cannot write will it. Only. You'll have to write option A is correctly given. Why? Because the son means actually things. Stand for it. And then one is equal to will not. I'll just actually remove that not. And something is left is will. So that's why will it. That question is okay. Even the statement is also okay. So that's why number A, option A is correct. But why can't I go to option B? The problem is that the son won't sign tomorrow because the son is never represented by C. When I change the pronouns of Sean, you know, I'll not change it into the C. In case, but the train, the train is kept on the third person singular. The train is equal to C but not the son. The son won't sign tomorrow. So again, 
once it's given in the uh, negative it is also given in the negative so this option c could not be okay and similarly number two we must be at school at eight o'clock aren't we sorry what is the negative form of must must not or need not it's up to you so whenever i change any just actually tag questions into a negative must into negative then just actually see i'll have to use a need not in place of must not yes must not means actually this is on idiomatic or i mean it is insensical or it cannot be used in the literal uh, sorry written actually the exposure so for this ladies and gentlemen will have to write need not so similarly pass me the salt pass me the salt or pass me the salt see now here the students can get confused you know pass me the salt aren't i on aren't i Pass me the salt, aren't you? Or pass me the salt, won't you? Yes. So just actually you have to underline everything because which sentences are correctly given in terms of tag questions over there. On the basis of tag questions, you'll have to find out which statement is correct. See, number three, there the students will have a problem. I'll not tell you now, once you complete this, then we will just actually, I will discuss regarding this tomorrow. I'll just actually bookmark this page over here. And once I'll open this page tomorrow, yes, I'm gonna bookmark this. Yes. Okay. I just actually did it. Now it is on my front page. Okay. So within this, I would like to just actually bid the goodbye because I'll have to start another class. Hello, sir, Rajendra, sir. Thank you very much. See you tomorrow. Hello, sir. Rajan, sir. Sir, good night, Azur. Have a sound sleep, Azur. Okay. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. <clears throat> Uh, guys, so we should have a sound sleep today. I have got my health problem, so uh, I want to conclude here, right? Today's session. Today, no, we have no more GK session. So tomorrow, at half seven, we will meet. Good night, sir. Good night, sir. Good night, sir. Good night, sir. Good night, sir.